Hey everybody, it's Jeff from New York and I'm here on the beautiful Norwegian getaway. Time for breakfast, it's my last full day of the cruise. We pull into port New York City tomorrow morning. Today I'm going to have breakfast at the uh, restaurant called Taste, which is a complimentary restaurant here, which means it's part of the meal plan. And uh, I had lunch there, it was pretty good, so we'll see how breakfast turns out. I'm thinking of ordering the Belgian waffles. I had waffles at the uh, buffet, at the Garden Cafe here on the uh, Norwegian getaway. The waffles were horrible, so <laughs> um, I'm hoping these Belgian waffles are a little bit better, but we'll find out. Come on down with me, we'll have breakfast and taste. This is Captain Morgan. He shows up in all cruise-related videos here on the New York channel. He shows up as a quick flash in the background, including this video. Be the first to spot him and leave a comment below with the timestamp where you spotted him, and you'll get a shout-out on an upcoming video. Good luck. This is the uh, atrium. They're always doing some kind of show here or some kind of group activity. They also show movies here during the day and evening. And uh, right in front of me is the atrium bar. Had many a drinks there. And a shout out to Deborah Camacho, who found Clarice the Miss America crown in my latest Atlantic City video, Caesars under heavy renovations. Congratulations, Deborah. Like I said, it's my last full day here on the ship and I want to make the most of it. Uh, visit some restaurants I haven't visited yet. I couldn't possibly visit everything in my, uh, believe it or not, 10 days on this ship. There were some short shore excursions too, so that took up some time, but even with all that time I had on the ship, I can't believe I just couldn't cover everything I wanted to. So, just gonna have to come back, right? Now, if you were paying attention at the beginning of the video, you'd know that we were on deck six. Deck six has a high concentration of restaurants. There are restaurants all over this Norwegian getaway, but deck six seems to be the highest concentration of restaurants more than any other deck. And they seem to be or tend to be specialty restaurants, which are not included in your ticket price. Now, a lot of these restaurants you are complimentary. You can come and go as you want, eat as much as you want, but there are certain restaurants called specialty restaurants that you have to pay for, pay extra. Um, sometimes, especially on Norwegian, when you buy a ticket uh, for, for a cruise, the specialty restaurants are included. You might get one specialty restaurant ticket or two specialty restaurants, depending upon how long your cruise is. I did get one ticket for a free specialty restaurant, and uh, I did try one out, and that video will be coming up shortly. Taste, the place we're going for breakfast right now, was complimentary. It's all included. Hey guys, I hope you're enjoying the video, and if you are, give it a thumbs up, and while you're at it, if you're not subscribed to the New York channel already, subscribe right now, it really does help the channel out. And while you're at it, if you'd like to support the New York channel, just click on that thanks button right underneath the video. I appreciate your support, guys. This is Mix, a cocktail bar right in between Taste and Savor restaurants. Taste is on the left hand, Savor on the right. We're having breakfast at Taste today. Mix is a great place to hang out if you're uh, waiting for a table at either Taste or Savor. Two complimentary restaurants here on the ship. And of course those cocktails are complimentary as well.
As you can see, the taste restaurant is decorated in blue and savor is done in red. I ordered the Belgian waffle, which looks much nicer than the one I had at the buffet upstairs. I came with a caramelized uh, banana slice. I had some hash browns, some breakfast sausage, some uh, warm maple syrup. I asked him to leave off the whipped cream. I think that's more for dessert than breakfast in my opinion. And it came with some whipped butter. And then I also ordered a uh, orange juice and black coffee. This Belgian waffle is much better than the waffle I had at the buffet. That video is available here on the New York channel. The one at the buffet was reminded me of a uh, like a frostbitten old Eggo waffle from the freezer uh, that just laid out a long time. This was obviously cooked to order or made to order, I should say. It was nice and fluffy. You know, when you're on the ship, it's such a hard decision or a tough decision to determine where you're going to eat. I mean, it's pretty much all included. So I could have gone to the buffet. Buffets are nice because, well, the variety is overwhelming. But the sit-down restaurants like here at Taste just serve better food, if you ask me. But the decision's yours, and if you're upstairs having a yucky buffet breakfast, well then just head down here to Taste or Savor and have a nice sit-down breakfast. Again, it's all included. It doesn't matter how many breakfasts you have. They really don't care here on the ship. If you want more sausage or hash browns, just ask. They'll bring it. Just a heads up if you're new to the channel, every time I order food, I only eat one thing at a time on my plate. So waffles gone, now on to the sausage. That's not a rule of mine, it's just usually the case. I didn't care for the sausage no matter where I ordered it on the ship, it just had no taste. Sausage should be uh, spicy, not hot spicy, but just spicy, and all the sausage on this ship seems to be bland. Hmm, maybe if I ask for a Bloody Mary, that'll spice things up a bit. And I don't want to sound like a whiner, believe me, everything, it's all good here, but uh, every time I ordered breakfast potatoes, whether it was hash browns or country potatoes or whatever, I always got these McDonald-like patty things, and I was always looking for like chopped potatoes with peppers and onions, and I never found that on the ship. Again, these were delicious, they just weren't what I was looking for. Wah, wah, wah. My breakfast was delicious and hearty and will definitely hold me over to lunch where I get another meal. Uh, this is Moderno and Cagney. Moderno is a Brazilian steakhouse and Cagney is a traditional steakhouse. Both specialty restaurants here on the Norwegian getaway. I hope you enjoyed this video, and if you did, please like, comment, ask some questions, and most importantly, subscribe by clicking on the button on the left. You can visit all of my New York videos by clicking on the top right, or check out my videos on other favorite places to visit by clicking on the bottom right. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you around the city.